This is Brian with Anderson Pens, and today I want to give you a sneak peek at the brand new Wall Eversharp Skyline Technique model. So here we have it in the box, and let's take a look at it. I really like this box. It's a nice black lacquered uh, box. It's got the nice Wall Eversharp logo uh, in gold on the top. Um, on the bottom, we've got felt lining, so it will. You have a nice desk. You won't have to worry about it scratching your desk. You can keep it on there. Let's open it up. We've got nice piano hinges here. In the top here, you can see we've got a Wall Eversharp warranty card. And this booklet here gives you a little history about uh, Wall Eversharp, uh, everything from Dorix to Skylines, uh, Henry Dreyfus, and, uh, and new owners, Sid Saperstein and a little history lesson there. So I'm gonna tuck that back in. Let's, uh, let's pull this out. Uh, the pen sits encased in a crystal case here, a rectangular case uh, inside a, a fur lined lining. And we can pull this out if you want and you can put accessories, other pens if you want on your desk or you can just leave this in here. Either way, Nice box, uh, nice presentation. So let's set that aside. Let's take a look at the, the pen here. Uh, case reminds me a lot of uh, Twisby. Uh, nice design. And it sort of sits there and it floats. So let's pull this guy out. This is a technique in cobalt. Now, if you're a, a Skyline fan, you will remember that uh, Parker came out with the, the Skyline uh, a number of years ago. And um, this is actually made with uh, the same tooling with a few modifications. It's also, you'll notice, very similar to the vintage Skylines. In fact, it's so similar, the gray one I have here on the right is, uh, is a vintage Skyline, that the clips uh, and the parts are interchangeable. Uh, the main difference, of course, being the vintage pen is a lever filler, where the modern pen is a cartridge converter. So. Uh, the clip here, we've got uh, the same ever sharp imprints with the double check mark. If you flip it over, uh, right here we have Wall Ever Sharp Skyline and Tiny Font, exactly like the original. So these parts, like I say, they do interchange. I could put this cap on this pen, not that I want to, or vice versa. Or if I needed the parts, you one could technically uh, swap the parts. So let's take a look here. The cap has got uh, nice uh, grooves on it, very nice and sharp. Uh, the pen has been machined out of a single block of aluminum. It's got a little bit of a step here. So uh, depending on where you grab, you've got actually a pretty comfortable comfortable range here. The, uh, the threads are actually very, uh, they're not sharp like some pens are, very not nicely done. Uh, the nib is made out of ceramic, a ceramic coated steel. Uh, it's got a nice Art Deco design on the on the nib, and the feet has been redesigned for this pen. So very nice uh, metal threads here as we open it up, and inside one of my favorite features is a threaded converter. Now I've already inked this guy up, but I like threaded converters because you know it's seated, you don't have to worry about it getting knocked out. Uh, leaking all over the inside of the barrel. It's a tight, tight fit, and uh, you're good to go. So fill it up, thread this back on, and let's take a look at the nib here. So the nib is a fine to medium semi-flex. Now that ceramic coating does a really wonderful job here. So let's, I can get a, a fine, fine line here. Ample ink flow. If I do it a little bit lower angle, I've got a medium nib. And if I want to apply a little pressure, I can get some flex to it. Nice flow to the nib. It's very smooth. Just a little bit of little feedback, not much, just enough to know that you're writing with a pen. Uh, very well done. I've been using it for the last two or three days, been very pleased with its performance. Uh, another one of the nice things about this pen 
if you're familiar with the vintage pens, you know that uh, one of the, uh, the big complaints is they don't really post very well. These post very well. Um, the old ones had a tendency to wiggle. This one is very solid, very secure. It's not coming off. The balance is very nice. And you're not going to have any problems with it. So there it is, the new Skyline Technique. Comes available in three different aluminum finishes. Black, uh, available with gold or the rhodium trim. Uh, cobalt blue or the natural aluminum which is a very attractive pen and also in the classic line which is very similar to the the original I have here with a gold fill cap and color matched uh, derby and barrel as well as a two-tone cap with gold uh, clip and that comes in a number of colors as well as rollerballs so the wall ever sharp new and right here at andersonpens.net